Hello, Visaya, this is Herman. I'm next to part of one of the most famous walls in the world, the Berlin Wall. This wall divided East and West Berlin physically and ideologically for 28 years. But have you ever dreamed to have the ability to see through walls? One of my favorite and creepiest of superheroes have this power. Well, at least if there's no lead around. So we're a long way to have abilities like the ones of the Man of Steel. What color underwear am I wearing? Hmm. But there are technologies that enable you to see through surfaces, allowing you to understand what's happening with your processes. So these are the five technologies you can use right now to measure your process without scratching the surface. One, ultrasonic flow meters. If you understand what industrial or press automation means, hashtag Piauto, you will for sure need some flow to be measured. This means that you understand the challenge you face when dimensioning a flow meter. You need to scale the sensor, check the pi diameters, primary elements, make sure that you can fit it, etc, etc, etc. Well, there are ultrasonic clamp flow meters that are able to measure the volumetric flow rate of your plant without any major changes in your infrastructure. Since this measurement is done using ultrasonic waves that go through the surface of your pipeline, Flexim and Siemens offer examples of this technology that uses the speed of ultrasonic waves in a fluid or the transfer time principle to calculate the flow velocity and volumetric flow rate. The working principle of these instruments can be explained using the moving walkways found in airports. If you walk in the same direction of the moving walkway, you move faster than when you walk against the moving walkway's direction. If you fire an ultrasonic wave at the same time but in opposite directions, ultrasonic flow meters are able to calculate the difference in transit time of the propagating ultrasonic wave. This difference is proportional to the flow velocity. 2. Corrosion measurement. Clamp ultrasonic flow meters are also used for highly corrosive or hazardous fluids. These fluids can corrode or erode the internal surfaces of the pipes. In these cases, non-intrusive ultrasonic corrosion sensors, like the PermaSense from Emerson, are used to measure the changes of the wall thickness of your pipelines. This way, operators can know the status of the infrastructure at any time and are able to plan any maintenance or replacement of the plant's infrastructure. 3. Surface temperature measurement. For corrosive or erosive fluids, or for pipelines with high flow velocities, Temperature measurement with traditional thermowells can be a challenge. In these cases, clamp-on thermometers like the Rosemont X-Well are used to measure the temperature surface of the pipeline. Also, in fire furnaces, skin-point thermocouples like Vika's TC59 are used to detect any hotspots in the carrying pipe inside the combustor chamber of the furnace. 4. Radar level measurement. Just like glass seems to be invisible to our eyes, well, some polymers are invisible to radar waves. In this way, it may be possible to measure the level of a polymer tank with no nozzles, using radar level sensors like the Vega Pulse 61. 5. Infrared temperature measurement. If you may remember one of our past videos, I talked about infrared temperature measurement. These sensors measure the thermal radiation emitted by hot objects. This way is possible to measure the surfaces of hot fluids, like molten metals, or a hidden engineer without the need to look inside the bag. Leave in the comments below your experiences with surface measurement. Thank you for watching. See you next week.